Hello and welcome to Pivot Point Patterns. My name is Melissa and today's video is my favorite kind of sewing video to make. We're going to do a thrift flip upcycle. I'm going to knock off this Free People t-shirt. I'm digging the contrast of the sleeves against the plain top and I love the boho vibe. But this is just too much money to pay. So I'm going to copy this look with this thrifted long sleeve t-shirt and sweater I picked up for $5. And we're going to make a matching skirt out of the leftover sweater. I cut the pink sleeves two inches above my elbow. Then I cut the sweater sleeves long enough to cover the back of my hand because we're going to make thumb holes. I tapered the sweater sleeve to match the opening of the pink sleeve, making sure to include a 3 8 inch seam allowance. Then I serged the sweater sleeve. You can use a zigzag stitch on your sewing machine if you don't have a serger. Turn the sweater sleeve inside out, and with right sides together, slide the sweater sleeve over the pink sleeve and align the edges. Pin in a circle. Sew the two sleeves together and turn the sleeve right side out. To make the thumb holes, I unpicked the original sleeve seam. It's hard to see, but if you stretch the sleeve along the seam, you'll see horizontal stitches holding the sleeve together. I picked out one inch of stitches and then tacked the ends of the opening. And now we have thumb holes! To make the skirt, lay out the sweater bodice, making sure the bottom edges are aligned. I used one of my knit skirts as a pattern and cut around it with a 3 8 inch seam allowance. Pin and sew along the sides. To make the elastic waist, wrap one inch wide elastic around your waist snugly with a one inch overlap. Cut and sew into a circle. So I forgot to hit record for this next step. I pinned and sewed the elastic waist to the right side of the skirt, stretching the elastic while I sewed. Then I flipped the elastic over and tacked the elastic to the side seams. And now we have a super cute outfit for fall. The sweater sleeves add a soft and cozy touch to a plain t-shirt and the skirt completes the outfit. I'm pretty happy with the way this turned out. I love the sleeves. I think it's really cute. But there's two things I would change if I could do this over again. I'm not liking the fit of this t-shirt. I would bring in the sides and probably cut off a few inches from the bottom. But overall, I think it's a cute outfit. That's it for today's video. If you enjoyed hanging out with me, hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you next time.